This week we bring you two interviews back to back. The first one is that of Shanti Swaroop Panda, CMO and brand custodian of Raymond, which completed 90 glorious years recently. We spoke to him about Raymond's latest ad campaign and about how the brand plans to stay relevant in rapidly changing times. Take a look. While it may be easy for a 90 year old brand to weather competitive pressures, uh, but given the changing consumer, is it tough uh, to stay relevant? See, any brand for it to be relevant has to adapt to the changing times in the society. No brand becomes relevant unless it is a reflection of what is happening in your society. If you look at Raymond as a case, since 1990 we have started the Complete Man campaign. Look at every campaign that we have done since then and each campaign actually reflects what, what is relevant for the society then and that's how we have been relevant. So today if you look at Raymond, it's no longer a brand which is uh, does the role of a contemporary bread uh, earner member of the family. Raymond Mann is a person who is an equal, who is always present with the family, he relishes and enjoys every moment around the family. So unless we start reflecting what is happening in society with the changing trends, the brand can't be relevant. In the 1980s, it was the guide to the well-dressed man and in the 90s, it moved to being the complete man. So what according to Raymond is the complete man? What is he really like? See for Raymond, the complete man is somebody who is a successful person, a leader, yet somebody who is not cold corporate being. Somebody who is really warm, who has value. Uh, strength of character, a person who derives all strength from the warmth of relationship around people uh, around him. And how do you attempt to ensure that your advertising reflects the brand's personality? Of course our advertising is what we want the brand to stand for and consumers should perceive the brand exactly the way we envision the brand to be in consumers mind. So if you look at last year's campaign, we started with something which is being there, which was all about a husband and wife, which is almost what uh, brings the brand to a contemporary platform. And here is a man who is no longer a bread earner, but an equal who is ready to share the responsibility and has the dexterity to share domestic uh, responsibilities with his wife. That's what makes the brand tick in uh, current consumer space. Can you talk us through your current campaign? Current campaign is actually set up in a socio-cultural en environment where all of us are distracted by the digital presence around us. So all of us try and live for posterity rather than living for the moment. And what the current campaign does is, is that it actually takes out a slice of life from a school annual function where most of the parents are actually scrambling to get a video shoot of what their kids are performing in a drama. They almost forget to applaud for the kids and the kids are really shocked. This is where the Raymond's Complete Man stands up, gives a loud applause and that's when everybody realizes that what they have been missing. So this again brings out the facet of what an endearing, charming uh, and warmth laden personality is the complete man. Raymond has traditionally used all media very extensively, be it TVCs or print. But which media according to you is the most effective in creating the most amount of brand recall? See there is nothing called uh, the most effective medium for us honestly and that's true for most of the brands today. It's all about who my consumer is and finally how do I reach and communicate to the consumer. More and more, today is the day and age where the one-way communication is no longer acceptable. So I can choose a TV as a medium, but TV only communicates one way. So as a relevant brand for today's society, I have to be present in a way and form in which there is a two-way communication and a relationship is built with my consumer. So we have to be present across channels. TV of course gives you the scale to reach immediately to a large set of people. But beyond that, there are other mediums who kick in and that's the role of having a two-way communication starts. So uh, with that, in fact, internet becomes very, very important. Well, that brings me to my next question. In terms of digital, what is the percentage of ad spends like? See, it's a good question. So we, we are just uh, almost on the verge of, you know, starting to spend a significant amount of our uh, media spends on digital. Uh, and we are having, a, uh, we are reshaping our digital strategy right now, so to say. There has to be a to and fro communication between us and the consumer. 
so we are we are now trying to be present across mediums which is social media as well as internet so that our presence is felt across and we are able to listen to the consumer to give you a broad number we could anyway be spending 10 to 15% of our future money is going uh, into digital and this is all in the space of art social media etc consumers are often fickle about their fashion choices and they don't mind switching loyalties so is your attempt then to be a lifestyle brand or a 90 year old legacy brand we talk of consumers who are fickle minded and you know it's almost like a flirtatious behavior that consumer uh, sports today brand still has a power and a value and uh, you talk to anyone saying which is the one of the best lifestyle brand raymond would be highest in recall so it it still has a lot of power as a brand and how do we make it relevant going forward and keep it relevant for the consumer is what the challenge is so i don't think consumer is so flirtatious that you know they just forget the brand of course the brand is important and it comes at a price given that e-tailing is very key to any player especially for a brand like raymond would you say advertising messages need to be more direct in terms of call to action or uh, than a message like the complete man we actually divide it and see it in two buckets one is an overarching campaign about the brand and the legacy that's what the complete man campaign is all about now that is not targeted as a call to action directly but we do move into product films beyond that and there are campaigns which are dedicated to specific product lines and designs for the season that we have so we have a dual uh, strategy of communication the first one overarching one being the uh, mother brand strategy which talks about the character uh, that builds raymond as a brand and below it comes the whole plethora of lines of product that we have which talks about call to action saying why you ought to buy a particular jacket or a trouser or a fabric or a shirt ready made shirt so this dual strategy is really working for us in last uh, one and a half two years and this is the way forward for us thank you so much for speaking to us and we look forward to many more such exciting campaigns and products uh, in the coming future thank you so much again for thank you We'll stop here for a short break but we'll be back soon with loads more on the other side. Stay tuned.